subscribe Ooh. because we're really utilizing the full body and the hips. Remember to use your modification with your hand on the ground as you're learning this move. But we're here for 60 seconds. Watch the modification if you need that mod, but keep working. Now, what you want to think about is keeping your chest low, right? Speaking of keeping chest low, Corey's going to hang your corner like this is what I wanted to do. I want to get even lower down towards the ground. Only 35 seconds for this move. Why, Jer? It's hard, man. It is hard. <laughs> you're working your legs. You're working your quads, man. Come on. Use the modification if you need to. Here we go. In three, two, one. Sit down. You are here for 60 seconds. Um, you do that. It took a whole minute to get it right. So take your time. You can start slow. Three, two, one. Pop up. Pop up. Get down and get up. Here we go. Now I'm going to show you Jess. Check this out. She's still working real hard. So she's stepping back and stepping forward. And up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Now keep going. Stay down. Let's check this guy out. Jess, let's go, man. Right. How you Here's what I want you to do. Slow down. What does slow down mean? Why do we do it? It means it works harder in your life. Hey guys, I just wrapped up day 13 of quarter force with Power Sculpt. Fight for it. I'm obviously missing my workout buddy today. He's traveling. So I had to do this workout on my own. And um, I have to say, working out without a friend in the house after you're used to that kind of sucks. Um, you really have to play the mental game and push yourself to do every move full out and not cave to that. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. I, you know, I deserve a break thing. Um, you really have to be your own worst critic and push yourself as hard as you can if you want to get the best results, right? So that's my tip for you guys today. We're, we're almost halfway through this program. Can you believe it? Um, so if you're working out by yourself or you're working out really early in the morning, get some Beachbody Performance Line Energize. It so, so helps to get going to your full capacity right at the beginning of your workout. I use it every day. Um, second thing is, is if you're not plugged into a challenge group, get plugged into a community of people who have your back, who are doing the same things you do and expect you to show up and share your journey along the way. It's I've always found in the last three years that it's so helpful to know that there's somebody else out there that's waiting on me to post and share, hey, I did it, and hey, I did my best, versus just being here alone, doing it in a vacuum, okay? So if you're not using the Energize, I highly recommend that, and if you're not plugged into a challenge group, get plugged into a challenge group. It's just an online community of supportive, positive people, and if you don't have a coach or don't have a challenge group to join, message me, my info is below, and I'd be happy to add you to ours, okay? I'm gonna go have some Shakeology. I'll see y'all tomorrow, bye.